Don't kill me, 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 Yo, 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 everybody. Generic P here, and welcome to Fade to Silence. This video is brought to you by the fine folks at THQ Nordic who are sponsoring this video. Da, 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 da. And uh, this game is available on Steam Early Access. If you guys are interested in checking it out for yourself, there's a link in the description below. All right. So, uh, what is Fade to Silence? It is a very interesting game. You know how I do. I always like try to compare two games. Uh, with each other. I'm gonna say uh, start the game while we're talking really quick because there's a little loading. Uh, it's, to me, it's kind of like Far Cry with For Honor and like a little like kind of Minecraft, <laughs> so, so to speak. Dead again. And it's real creepy. Cold, pale flesh, a feast for maggots. But the maggots have to wait. Ugh. Maggots. I'm not finished with you. Not yet. That's the bad dude, I think. You failed. I triumphed. Oh. A new cycle begins. All right, so you only get so many lives in this game, and each life is represented by one of these little flames around me, right? And once those flames are gone, I think it's game over. So one of the challenges I'm going to try to do is see how long I can last without dying, and you guys know me. <laughs> I mean, I played a little bit of this just to get the hang of it. My combat Go skills... Go on and yep. fight, okay. but yep. know Hold this. On. When the last flame goes out, those flames there. There's no more resistance. Da, da, da. I I am terrible at the combat in this game, just because I'm terrible at combat. But we're gonna try it together, okay? Destroy. No one remains. Mm -hmm. You are alone, sinking in a sea of corruption. I'll soon drown you. Okay. Now, what's really cool about this is it looks like uh, it's one of these fantasy type realms, you know, kind of like, I don't know, like Skyrim type of thing. But in reality, it's the real world. But like, you'll see like old pickup trucks and stuff. It's just like there's all these nasty demons and stuff that have taken over and like the corruption, which I think is really cool. Okay. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Hey, I gotta get a torch. There we go. Okay. No, you don't. Hey, stop that. Stop that. Stop that. Hey, dude, give me a chance. Give me a chance. Okay. Ed, get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. No. Come on. Yeah, Ed. Get him. Get him. Yes. Get so messed up. Get so messed up. I'm hurting, though. Only another of my strongholds. Ignore it. Alright, so there's these crystals. And it, it, you've got to like cleanse it, and it makes it makes like the area around you like uh, cleansed of the corruption, cleansed of the blight. Resistance. How dare you defy me? And so that's why I I feel like it's it's got that Far Cry vibe to it, right? Because of like okay, so you see here. Survive. Find food and firewood. Rest near campfires. Take shelter from blizzards. Because you have to worry about uh, your hunger and your cold and, and all of that, right? And, of course, damage done to you. Recruit so you can recruit other survivors. Lead your followers. Rebuild your refuge. So there's, like, a definite... I'll show you, like, the cool, like, uh, base building aspect to this. Um, and then cleanse. So this is where I think it's, like, Far Cry. Like, destroy the corruption stronghold, secure the outpost, conquer new territory. And it's all done in such a, a unique way. Like, I say that aspects of that are, like, Far Cry, but this is this is not Far Cry. It's, like, way different. Take out a life collecting sticks and bits of rotten food. Toil without ceasing. Or just lie down in your grave, waiting peacefully for your inevitable end. 
What a jerk. Man, he's such a jerk. All right, so that one thing you saw me do, if I hold down the left left button, because I'm using a controller right now, this is where it'll highlight the stuff that is nearby to pick up. And so that's what I'm doing. All right, and it tells me it wants me to find campfire. Reflections of your deranged mind. He sure likes talking. Ignore them. Okay, so we've got some of this stuff now, and it's essentially a type of crafting material uh, that we're getting. But uh, he wants us to come up here, right, and find this little jam. Okay, we got a refuge stash, which right now there's nothing in it. Uh, I don't know if it's because it's early access or if that's something that will come later once we have the workers, the refugees working for us. I'm, I'm thinking that's what it is. But we can sit down, right? And here's where you have your different types of things. So we can craft, and this is, this is the cool part about it. You have to go get resources, and then you have to use those resources to help yourself with survival, right? So we've got, uh, uh, I wanna try to get an ax, hopefully, this, this episode, I don't know. Uh, a sword would sure be great. And then, like, there's all these type of, uh, uh, you know, like, healing and food and, and such and so forth. Um, and then here's my inventory and the crafting. Okay, so, that being done, let's... We seem to be fine on everything. We're not really tired or nothing. And so let's go on this merry way. I, I actually... Oh, dude, is that food for me? No. Um, I actually may need to sleep a little bit to try to heal up. That might be a good idea. So let's let's just do three hours. Why not? Why not? And yeah, that healed me up a little bit. Okay, and let's get out. You're <laughs> resting. You're not even close to death. <laughs> Live. He's, he's such a jerk. Hey, right, and so now if we go, we'll do a little run job. Oh, the, I want to show you so we can do some construction. And this is the, the type of stuff where, like, you can, this is where our old camp used to be. And so you can go through and you can make a hut, a medicine hut, crafting shack. And you can see all of those. Uh, crafting shack allows a follower with the bush crafting skill to create a wide variety of primitive tools. Forge, workshop, sledding kennel, which is so cool. And a palisade gate, stairs. I mean, just tons of crazy stuff. And so uh, there is a base building and base defense aspect to this game as well. Now keep in mind, this is early access, so maybe not everything is in place right now, but they will be putting out uh, large content upgrades as the development continues. Okay, oh, dude, look at that. See that bad guy right there? I do not want to be near him whatsoever. But I do. I did a little scan job. And there's some stuff under here. See, so that's the that's a cool uh, a cool little thing to know cuz otherwise it might be really really hard to see where all of this stuff is. And it's good because we got blight bane, we got some blood blood hall. Is that what that said? Blood hall. All right. And now shall continue on and this okay so there is there's a bad guy right there I can't quite lock on to him yet but I'm gonna do a little sneak job and then maybe just maybe we can attack on him from their branches. Okay, oh oh no he found me okay yeah, get him. And go, go, get him. Oh, ho, ho. It's good, it's good, it's good, it's good. Okay, don't freak out, don't freak out, don't freak out. Okay. And get him. And. Nicely done. Nicely done. Okay. I'm a little bit. Uh, I'm way better at this than when I first started. Combat's hard for me. Just in general. Not just in this game. I'm just terrible at the reflex job. Okay, so now as we're walking around here, right? I guess I can put my put my thing away. Uh, as we're walking around, 
then you'll notice like on the little mini map some new stuff starts showing up so you can uh-huh start going through and seeing so we'll see what all this stuff means so the eclipse i don't know what the eclipse is but that is that the bad guy that might be the bad guy um but you can start looking around you can see okay there's some larger ones of those uh outposts that we need to take care of but we could just kind of walk around every once in a while do a little scan job see if there's new things to know about oh okay there's a guy okay he's gonna know about me yep now he knows about me okay i don't want to know about you. there we go hey come on and there we go oh, oh. And get him. Yes. Okay. Go, 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 go. No. Don't spit. Don't spit. There we go. Get so messed up. Get so messed up. I am the best at this game. <laughs> All right. And now if we do a little scan, there should be some stuff around here. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. There's some stuff way over there. Oh, yeah. We've come across something. Hello, what you is? Oh, oh, God, what? Where are you is? Oh, hey. Dead. Yep. Wait for it, wait for it. Gotta get my strength back. And. and. Get it, get it. Oh, no, no. Yep. Thank goodness. Woo. And what, we got some arrows? And then something in here. What do we have? Grub root? And some fiber, which is a material that we can use uh, to either make some like bows and arrow stuff. Uh, probably need it for the axe. I think we need a couple at least. So it's good to know. All right, and then aha! Now something's showing up on the mini map. Oh, but am I cold? I'm getting kind of cold, but that's fine. Now's the jam. Here's what we need to find. There's a there's a thing. Uh, oh, what are you? Another uh, no, bad thing. Oh yeah, there's bad. I don't want to mess with that. Let's go. Let's quickly head over to. Oh, there's another one of those guys. Okay. Will he know about me? <laughs> yep. Uh, uh. Oh. Oh. Heck. Oh my. Good lord. Was not expecting that. Jeez. What was that all about? All right, we'll do a little... Wow, look at that outpost up there. Man, that's cool. Uh, I am watching my hunger, which we don't have food. Uh, but I think we'll be able to make some food here in just a little bit. There's something here, I hope. Let's do a little scan job. Anything around? Yeah. Hello, hello? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. Oh, God. Why are you doing that to me, dude? Give me a chance. Give me a chance, would you? Okay, that's some salvage. Dude, that's brutal. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Is this the place? Yeah, so we have some, oh, some pristine wood. Excellent, excellent. Some firewood. Grub root. Okay, uh, and open that up. Oh, one dose per hour of rest to boost health recovery? Oh, yes, please. He healing tonic. Oh, and we got some food. Oh, baby. Okay. You know what? I'll use some of that food right now. Because we have three. Okay, so that, that's helped quite a bit with our food technology. Now, here's the thing. We can't use this because the fuel is one campfire. But I can't actually make the stuff yet. I think I have to go back to my jam to my place and do it and that's fine we can do that but before we do there is a bad thing right over there let's let's maybe mess with that let's go huh sneaky sneak this is one of those one of those like little outposts i don't know exactly what they're called but this is like a minor one so the trick is you just sneak up to it uh oh or or not and make it, make it, hey, make, make it bad. Right, right. Oh, God. Oh, no. 
Hey, yo. Hey, stop, stop. I'm on that. I'm on that. Bro, go for it, Clint. Clint, don't kill me. Don't kill me, 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 don't kill me. Dude, we did it. But I died. Dang it. Dang it. Alright, but, so we've seen this one, right? Alright, so now one more of the little things have, have happened, but I think now if we look at our inventory, yes, we still have the stuff. Thank goodness. At least you don't lose that, because that would like really make a man sad. Well, I lost the longest the longest going without dying challenge, I feel sure. But we knew. We knew that's how it was gonna work for me, right? I mean, let's not kid ourselves. Hey, but a hey, good news. We're not hungry anymore. <laughs> and so we can sit down and let's see what we can make now. Do a little craft job. Uh-huh. Okay, we can make the axe. Wonderful. And hello. Wait for it. And eh, okay. Uh we are missing pristine wood and a fiber. Although we can make a fiber from a grub root. Yeah, so let's let's make one more food. So that makes some food for us. Now we have three food, that's good. Uh, and then we can take that fiber. Okay, so now what we're missing is some pristine wood. We have one. We need this much. How much firewood does that make? Because I, I can't really tell. We're going to try it and see if that's enough to make a campfire. It ain't. <laughs> Dang it. It made five. Pecker. Okay. So, but, uh, let's get, let's get out of here. The one good thing about it is that we should be able to, I think, uh, oh, let's go into our inventory, and now we can equip that as our, as our axe, instead of, uh, so now let's check it out, oh man, yeah. look at that thing, oh hell yeah, we gonna mess things up right now, alright, and now we can go back, I guess I'll hold it, now we can go back to where there is on the map, Right here, there was like a wood cutting area. So we can go check that out and see what happens now that we have this axe. What do you do? You just like chop down trees? Is that how this works? Would be nice. And then we can get like a bunch of wood to take care of business. Do you just walk up to it? Action menu. Okay, we don't, we can't assign anybody yet because we don't have the, the technology. So do I. Uh huh. Now I've got it. Hey. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, it said interact. I, see, I saw the interact. Hold on. Interact. And chop. And we're chopping. And we're chopping. And we're chopping. And we're chopping. Chop. Timber. Them down. Yes. Destroy the resistance. Okay. What do we got out of that? Ooh. A downfall. So there's pristine wood. There's firewood, and then there's this tainted wood that can be processed to firewood by a skilled woodcutter if we had such a person. Okay, now can I get the, yeah, this little guy? Oh, let's get this, this dude. <laughs> he's, a, he's a jerk. He's a total jerk. Okay, and got another pristine wood, got some firewood, got, got the tainted wood. Oh, and now it's dark. Let's chop down a couple more of these bad boys. Okay, there's probably less in here. Uh, got a bunch though. I mean, why is my, oh, there we go. And then another big boy right here. Interact? Yes. Okay, so this is good because, uh, okay, chop and pick it up. So how many, we got four, four wood, a ton of firewood. And then that's all we can get from this thing right now. Okay, and it's super dark. Let's go back. Meanwhile, back at the base. Now, I'm curious about this. If we were now in our spot. Okay, that's the construct. Okay, that's not what we want to go for quite yet. We want to maybe make a, maybe a sword? Oh, you know what we need for a sword? I think we need more salvage, which we didn't find any of that. That's okay though. Let's see what we can make. We were missing, I think, the bow. 
with the uh, with the pristine wood. And now that we have four, it should be a little bit more better. But we're gonna get right into it. Sit down and do a little thing. Okay, what what are we missing here? We're miss. Uh, it won't let us do it because we need to. I think drop some junk off in this salvage box. I think that's what's going on. So we go over here. Uh, how we do? There we go. And drop. Drop, drop, drop. Drop, drop, drop. And then that should be okay, I think. Now we can go. We can do the craft job. Yes. Okay. So now we're good here. We have 17 arrows. So that is making the bow. I hope that arrows are made out of firewood. Let's check. Oh, they're made out of pristine wood. Really? So let's try one. Let's see. One pristine wood. We have 17 right now. So it makes 20. Okay, that's not too bad, actually. I'm okay with that. And, hey, hey. Right? Because we have campfire stuff boom and we can make a couple campfires so the next time we're out and about we can set up shop there oh and then look we can make a makeshift uh let's get out of here we can make a makeshift shelter with the firewood so let's grab three of those oh no just two that's fine and then we'll come down in here and we will make craft ourselves up a makeshift shelter and that'll be beneficial if we're out out in the wilderness we don't have to worry about getting getting caught anymore we can basically put a makeshift shelter anywhere we want it oh, oh okay well all right fellas i think i'm gonna let this be it for this episode hope you guys enjoyed if you want to see more of this be sure and drop a like on the video and if you want to grab this game yourself there is a link in the description below to grab it. And once again, thank you to THQ Nordic for sponsoring this video. Thank you so much. Love you guys. And until next time, take care. Brush your hair. I'll see you when I see you. Brush. Brush your hair.